Guys, this is going to be a video how to get and use Steam Desktop Authenticator because a lot of you guys were asking me on my Jackpot tutorials. So what you're going to do is you're going to go click on the link I put in the description. And it'll take you to this page right here. Now the biggest mistake a lot of people make is they push this download button. You don't want to do that. You want to scroll down a little bit and push this download button. Even right here it says clicking this one up here will not work. You have to click this button right here. So once you download that, it'll download a uh, folder. And that folder will be like this. They won't have the one because this is the second one I just downloaded. So you open that. It'll let me do it. So you'll get something like this. It might not have as much clutter in it because I've already started it. But what you do is you look for the application. Like it might not show the picture here, but just look where it says application here. And you'll start this and you'll hit run. And now once it's open, you're going to want to say set up new account. You'll put in the username or password, and then it's going to send a text to your phone. You just have to put that in there. It'll be all set up, and you, your accounts will come up right here. And you, here's the live code for it. You can also view confirmations for that account. So, there you go. Um, so you can also get the secrets for your account. So if you go like this, and you go to your MA files here, and hit open with Notepad, you can get all your shared secrets and identity secrets and all that for your accounts. And that's about all there is to it. If you guys have any questions, leave it down in the comments. Uh, I'm also going to be making the roulette tutorials and the coin flip tutorials very soon, so leave a like if you want those. Thank you guys for watching.